My name is Tanya Golash Bosa, and I'm an assistant professor in sociology and American studies. I put together five posters. Um, each of the posters has a picture of a couple's hands. So each of these couples are made up of two people, a U.S. citizen woman and a Mexican man who is undocumented. On either side of the picture are two stories. Uh, one is the story of the couple's hands and the other is a story to, of another couple who's in a similar situation to them. The history behind this project, I was in Chicago doing research and um, one of the areas I was researching was immigration policy. So I approached um, a nonprofit and asked them if there's any way that I could work with them on some of their projects um, in order to develop my research agenda. And they told me that they were interested in developing um, a policy-oriented program um, that they wanted to present to legislators, which is to change the 245I section of the Immigration Nationality Act. And what this means is that when an undocumented person marries a U.S. citizen, um, sometimes they're not eligible for legalization. And it's really just a small provision in the law that they wanted to change. So they asked me if I could collect stories from their clients in order to um, present these stories to legislators and try and enact some sort of policy change. And for me, it was an ideal opportunity because um, as researchers, we often want our ideas to come from the community as opposed to us just imposing our projects on um, the community. So that's how the project started itself. The importance of the relationships between the U.S. I would have liked to use their faces since they're undocumented that would put them at risk. So undocumented people have to live a sort of anonymous life, but if you're a U.S. citizen married to an undocumented person, you also have to live a sort of anonymous life. A lot of the work that I do doesn't fit just in sociology. I draw from anthropology, from geography, from political science, from legal studies, um, even from the humanities, from literature, all of those things, cultural studies to do my work. For me, what was very attractive about the Department of Sociology is actually a very unique department nationally in that um, most of the researchers are qualitatively oriented um, and sort of look use more interpretive methods to understand society. And so when I wrote the stories, I just wrote them based on what people told me. It's my hope that somehow, that something in the stories will strike a chord with people that are reading them. Um, and I think the advantage of having several stories is that maybe not every story is interesting to every person, but um, having the hands kind of provides a human connection and potentially some of the stories, uh, people might be able to relate to them in one way or another and just maybe get them thinking about the impact of immigration policy on everybody.